am going to share with you guys my brilliant veneer pressing bag hack that I came up with. So imagine this, it's March 2020 and I get my stimulus check and I decide to splurge on the pressing system. But I don't have a platen and I don't have any way of making a platen because all the community shops are closed. So I came up with this idea and it's been working out really well for me. Here's my platen. It's three quarter inch plywood and I rounded the corners. The layer on top is framing mat. I bought a sheet of it at Michael's and then I covered the whole thing in plastic sheeting. Over the platen is plastic fencing. I bought a roll of it at Lowe's. It goes over the entire top, wraps around, and is under the entire bottom. The end I made a little bit longer and I rolled it up so there's multiple layers and just tacked it with thread. And finally the bag. My platen is a little bit more narrow than the four foot bag that I bought because that is as wide as the trunk of my car. As the air is being sucked out, I hold the nozzle up against those multiple layers of fencing. And even if it goes through one or two layers, it never reaches the platen. Before anyone gets kind of weird and tells me that this hack system isn't gonna work in the long term and they've been woodworking longer than I've been alive, I just wanna say that I've made all of these pieces using this kind of sketchy hack system and it's worked out perfectly well.